to show you this really nice installation that uh, our friends in Aronet has done. So this is the Aronet 30. It's a customer boat from one of our great customers in southern Norway. They're called Fremskrit Lux. Uh, and this uh, installation that we can see here is from Evoy. This is the 400 horsepower Hurricane. Uh, everything is centered on the motor skid. So it means that cooling, pumps, everything that you need for that part of the job is on the motor. It means that it's really easy to install, it's easy to take it out if you need. Uh, and it's, it's really those plug and play feature that's so important for Evo, just for quality, for maintenance, and, and this is what we can see here. Uh, there's chargers, there is uh, the PDU is on the side here, the DC-DC is under the side, and everything is connected to a Bravo stern drive. Uh, this is a 3XR, so it means it's a duo prop. Uh, which also gives really nice efficiency and, and good range. 10 meter boat, uh, it's 2.8 meters wide and uh, around five, five tons. All we have to do is press the neutral and the boat is active and uh, off we go. In the beginning here, you'll probably hear a little bit of summing from, uh, from the back. It's, the, it's actually the, um, the stern drive that you hear, it's not really the motor. And, uh, now we're ready to go. You don't need to heat up the motor or the battery or anything. It's just to, just to gun it really when you get on board. And that's something that a lot of our customers really appreciate. If you run three to five knots uh, in this boat, you can run all day long. So on board here, uh, there's 250 kilowatt hours of battery. And uh, in three knots, you'll run 100 nautical miles easily. Uh, if you take it up to about five knots, you can see in my screen here that I have around 60, 70, nautical miles and of course let's uh, also try her up to speed. The torque is capped at uh, 707 uh, the, uh, newton meters. If we didn't have the cap it would accelerate a lot quicker uh, but it's still a pretty fast accelerating boat. Um, so this boat will do over 40 knots any day pretty much and uh, in, when you're uh, correctly trimmed and everything it's, it's a really nice ride. Uh, in this speed, of course, you won't run very long, you're like 20 nautical miles. But if we slow down here, this is 41 knots. So if we slow down and take her down to around 27 knots, where she uh, goes really nicely and really economically, uh, you will see now that the range here is, is coming up above 30 nautical miles, which is really quite cool. There's, there's not that many electric boats on a single hole that will do the speeds.